U.S. policy toward Iran is one of the most controversial topics in the presidential campaign. On the Republican front, Senator John McCain has called the crisis with Iran, quote, the most serious crisis we have faced outside of the entire war of terror since the end of the Cold War. In a much anticipated move, McCain announced his vice president at the convention in Dayton, Ohio on August 29. He chose the governor from Alaska, Sarah Palin. After serving as a senior senator from Arizona for over 20 years, McCain accepted the Republican nomination on September 4th. Major issues mark this presidential election, specifically Iran. Regarding military action against Iran, McCain has said, quote, I pray every night that we will avoid a conflict with Iran. There's a whole lot of things we can do before we seriously consider the military option. I still say there's only one thing worse than military action against Iran, and that is a nuclear-armed Iran. He says the United States could not accept a nuclear-armed Iran, and he backs much tougher financial and trade sanctions against Tehran. However, McCain has been criticized by many fellow senators for not following up his speeches against Iran, such as Senator Frank Lautenberg, who criticizes McCain for not standing up to party leaders and big oil for more sanctions against Iran. McCain still speaks out against Iran, though. He has accused Iran of training militants to attack U.S. troops in Iraq and of supporting the Iranian-backed Hezbollah group in Lebanon. His running mate Palin has announced her views in her acceptance speech on September 3rd. Palin attacked Barack Obama for a stance on issues including Iran. Alluding to Obama's stated willingness to personally meet with Iranian leaders as near ridiculous, saying that, quote, terrorist states are seeking nuclear weapons without delay. He wants to meet them without preconditions. He's worried that someone won't read them their rights. She reinforced the idea by McCain that a nuclear armed Iran would be an unacceptable danger for us all. Obama has responded by making the comparisons of McCain to Bush using the same tactics of saber rattling. <laughs>